Good morning, everyone. Wanted to show you something I got that might help you guys out a little bit. I went out and bought the CB Life Wolf Covert Red Dot. Let's show you what comes with it, and then we'll start talking about it. Your instruction manual. Your lens cleaning cloth. It gives you four different screws for mounting options. Six millimeter, six and a half, eight, and 11 millimeter. Gives you two batteries, 1632 for the power. You got your windage and elevation screwdriver. You got a torque wrench here. You got another torque wrench and extra screws for the Picatinny plate that comes with it. And you also get the Glock MOS mounting plate, which is really cool because most places don't include that. I'm comparing this to the Hollisons. So let's jump right into the red dot. I told you it does come mounted in the box to a Picatinny rail. That is real easy. All you gotta do is get a number 10 Torx. Take this off, which I'm gonna do. So there is your Picatinny rail if you don't wanna use it. There is your red dot. So fairly simple. Right on top is your windage and elevation. That side, you have your right and left, your windage, and then top is elevation, sorry. But it is a 3 MOA right there on the side. It's got a plus button on the left-hand side and a minus button on the left on the right-hand side. Uh, those are how you turn it on. The, one of the nicest things I found about this one is you can hit either button to turn them on and off. It looks like two seconds. Hold it. But it's got a motion detecting technology. I don't want to use shake awake because that's somebody else's. This has motion detecting technology, which just means if you don't use it for about four minutes or longer, it will shut down. But the minute it detects uh, motion, it'll turn it back on. So I do like that from a self-defense standpoint, because that's what all my guns are. They're not competition, they're not playtime. They're self-defense firearms. This would be good because I could just turn it on, leave it next to wherever I put it, and it's always ready. So I like that technology to it. It's a one MOA click. So if you're out doing your zeroing, remember one MOA. That would be one inch at 100 yards, half inch at 50 yards, quarter inch at 25 yards, and about eighth inch, three sixteenths at 10 or 15 yards. So keep that in mind. It's your standard RMR footprint. Got nice clear glass. I really like the glass on it. The dot is easy to pick up. I mean, you can't get any better than this. This one right here was like 90 some odd dollars, 93 or 96 bucks with the coupon on Amazon. I got it down to like $89 or 86 bucks, something like that. I'll put the link. I don't know if the coupons are still there, but I'll put the link below later. And um, you guys can take a look at it if you like it. One thing it did come with, I don't know what I did with mine. It does come with like a rubber boot or a rubber cover that goes over it. So if you're storing it at home, you can put that cover on it. I don't use them, so I don't know what the heck I did with it. I probably tossed it in one of those nine toolboxes back there. So if you're looking for it, this glass is super clear. I really like it. So... Please, if you're looking for a red dot to learn on, this is very inexpensive. And I think as of now, from what I've seen, the quality is there. So if you do get one, let me know below. If you have any questions about it, let me know. I'll try to help you. Um, I'm going to start recommending this one for my red dot classes for people that come out. I might even buy a bunch of them and provide it in the class. So we'll see what happens. You guys have a good day. You guys take care. Be safe.